So just a question from the community as well. Um, SegWit versus Bitcoin Unlimited. What's your opinion on it? Okay. Um, so this is, the, this is the kind of uh, really, really difficult question. Um, but at the same time, it's fairly easy. Um, I'm in favor of activating SegWit. I'm in favor of activating SegWit now. The reason for that, and don't applaud, uh, for, form your own damn opinion. I am no more the authority you should listen to than anyone else. This is not a system of belief where I said FC Barcelona, and you go, yeah! Make up your own mind. I'll tell you why I think that's true. Um, I think SegWit should be activated now because it solves a number of different problems. Uh, it's, a, it's the best tested solution that exists. I also think that I, I will make a disclosure. I used to think that big blocks would be better about two years ago. And I ran classic NXT to evaluate them. I ran Bitcoin Unlimited too. Not because I thought that we should hard fork to those, but to evaluate the software and understand how it works. And if the choice was SegWit versus classic, I might say, you know, a year from now we could also do a bump through classic. The problem with unlimited, in my opinion, is that it doesn't change the rules. It changes or sets the rulers who then get to change the rules. And that is a very dangerous thing to do in Bitcoin, especially if it's done as a contentious hard fork. Um, I think Bitcoin Unlimited is a completely untested system of consensus. If somebody wants to test that with 51 percent, it's going to be an interesting experiment. Um, Bitcoin is going to get attacked eventually. Maybe it's better if it gets attacked sooner rather than later. If you hold Bitcoin as an investment, uh, this will be painful. So hard forking Bitcoin with a low percentage and without very broad consensus will damage Bitcoin. We will end up with two chains that will survive, and the sum of their value will be far less than the sum of value we have in Bitcoin today. I think that's a very bad idea. Not my choice. However, here is something I can tell you. Bitcoin is a currency as a means of exchange. The way I use it for getting paid for my job works at $200, at $2,000, and at $20. It doesn't change for me. Bitcoin as a stable store of value however, doesn't work with a hard fork. So it really depends on what you use it for. And there's probably a broader discussion to be had there. Let's see if we have some more questions. <music>